Hi there guys, Cromad here with iMusic for Macintosh and today I'm going to be showing you how to import music from a USB or flash drive to iTunes. So we're using the Macintosh version of the software today. If you don't already have it, you can download it from the website on your screen now. Uh, I'll launch iTunes with iMusic, there's our plugin there. You can just uh, add files in here by, you can just drag and drop them. So I'm just gonna drag in one file here. There we go, and as we see, it's a duplicate. So I'm just gonna uh, delete these, and then drag in the album again to show you how this works. So you can just drag and drop, and they'll be added to your library. You can also click File, Add to Library, and that will bring up a dialog box here. I can just add in a file there. And as we see, excellent. So as you can see, there's two versions of the song in where I've added them in twice. However, iTunes does only support a limited number of file types. So it will do MP3, AIFF, WAV, MPEG-4, AAC, and Apple Lossless, which is M4A. If you wanted to add anything else to your iTunes library, um, then you can import it directly from a USB or flash drive to your iTunes library using iMusic. So I'm just going to close this here. And all we need to do is either drag and drop onto the library or click on Toolbox and then click Convert Music. And I'm just going to select this FLAC file that I have sitting on my desktop. Then we can um, get those converted. And what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna get that exported to my desktop here. We can click Convert, and then that will convert the file through. So in this case, I've got Radio Silence now coming through as an MP3 onto my desktop. It will open up nicely in a folder there. And then all I need to do to add it to my iTunes library is just drag and drop it either into iTunes or into iMusic. And that is how you uh, convert files that are not supported by iTunes and get them onto an iTunes library. Thank you very much for watching. We'll speak to you next time.